While fireworks on the 4th of July can be a lot of fun, but for our pets, those loud booms can create stress, sometimes causing them to run off. Here with some simple tips to prepare pets uh, before the holiday is Dr. Angelica Demick, a veterinarian from the Animal Humane Society. And welcome to you and Grace today. Yes, this who, is Gracie. She, Gracie is adorable, looking for a home in the next few days mm -hmm. here. She'll be available. What happens to animals when they hear these sounds? Well, a lot of dogs and cats can have almost the equivalent of a panic attack, which humans will have. Um, so they can be pacing, barking, whimpering, hiding, uh, showing just scared, scaredness and anxiety, basically. You are here today to talk about ways uh, preemptively to, to make the animal calm. What are some things to keep in mind here? So the biggest and easiest way to get them adjusted to these sounds is to start slowly acclimating them to it. So there's a lot of apps and websites nowadays that have the firework sounds, mm -hmm. and you can start uh, especially like right now, about a week before the big day, is having the volume down low, playing with them, giving lots of treats, and then over the days just slowly increase the volume so that it gets pretty loud, all the time giving them treats and making a really positive play experience, and that'll get them more acclimated to the, to the big day. <laughs> The, Gracie is wearing uh, something called Thunder Patch here. Uh, what is that? What does that do? So this is a, a shirt that uh, kind of gives, it's kind of a little tight on them and mm -hmm. it gives them like a feel of like a hug. Uh, so it can help reduce anxiety for some dogs without having to put them on medication. So easy to put them on with mm -hmm. a little Velcro there. Yep. Uh, you mentioned medication now in some extreme cases, that's really the way to go, isn't it? Unfortunately, yeah. yes. Uh, so uh, initially, you can always try some over-the-counter supplements that might help calm the dog. Uh, just try them out several days in advance to see if they work. If, uh, if that doesn't work, you can always try putting them in an interior room without windows and having like calming music mm -hmm. on. If that doesn't help, talk to your veterinarian. There are some anxiety medications that can help. Well, we appreciate your insights here today. Thank you. Let's hope for a calm one uh, <laughs> for the animals, especially here. Uh, Gracie, available in the next few days mm -hmm. in Golden Valley at the Animal Humane Society. Yes. I hope she finds a good home. She's a sweetheart.